What is up my Richard Bakes and welcome to some Yeah, probably be some Call of Duty gameplay because quite really I have no other gameplay to use to be honest that'll be entertaining unless you wanna see me walk around for ten hours straight on Rust trying to get fucking wood and stone. Which I don't think people would like to see to be honest. I wouldn't like to see. But if you do I live stream sometimes if I can. Also just wanna say before this starts I hope to be getting another monitor, so I'll have three monitors, so I can put my computer on two screens, so I can have chat uh, and my social media and everything up on my left, and then on my right I can just game. So that's going to be good. So today, guys, I just want to talk about PewDiePie, PewDiePie or Pubes, Pubes, whatever the fuck you want to call his name. The guy who has a load of fucking subs, and he's all fucking good and everything. Well, he's a racist, guys. He's a goddamn fucking racist. It is disgraceful how racist he is. He's racist to Jews. He's racist to other people as well. Like he's he he's a racist, right? If the if the news outlet says he's a racist, then he's a racist. Yeah. Ball in all fairness, guys, he, like, what the fuck, he is not a racist, where does this come out of, I don't understand, like, the debt to all Jews, but yet, he was sh showing us what people would do for money, and he said, debt to all Jews, comma, everyone forgets the comma, ke uh, Keemstar, drama alert, and, like, it's just a joke and he paid someone fiver as well or five dollars five pounds five euros whatever the fuck turkish lira shit bollocks tits um to a guy that looks like jesus to say hitler did nothing wrong which to be honest is fucking funny as fuck i think maybe because i just have a really really dark sense of humor mm. I think that's why I have like a terrible, terrible like. I'll make terrible jokes about stuff, but like that's that's not bad. Like he's not being racist or anything. He's just messing around saying that. That's like saying a comedian can say stuff about retarded people or something like that. Like take the likes of Frankie Boyle. If you don't know him, he's a person. Or, uh, he's a comedian that is on mock of the week as well and oh my god the shit that he comes out with is just unbelievable like it's just so funny that it's just so bad at the same time but like pewdiepie isn't a racist and for maker studio to drop him is just ridiculous like he's probably he's one of the most subscribed most viewed like he's gonna make so much money for the company and himself like it's ridiculous and he's just you have such a big audience there that you can get your name out more on PewDiePie's channel like say uh, say just a uh, T Martin I don't know how many subs he has one two three million whatever it is like that's three million people that'll see your content if he uploads your content or says hey subscribe to this guy Towards PewDiePie who has 56 60 million maybe I, I actually can't remember but whatever he has Like that's a huge huge gap in the market that you can just exploit by having him as your Kind of like platform to get your name out there and everything i just find it so stupid that they dropped him like that and he wasn't racist he's not a racist or anything and i find it ridiculous that the news outlets will jump on anything and say he's a racist there was another thing that the news outlets jumped onto before over in england i think it was and it was completely false it was something about a cop like beating and raping some kid and he never even did that like, it's just so fucked up the shit that people come out with the news outlets come out with for for views and shit and it's really really sad and 
Like, the only person I've watched video about this is PewDiePie's and, well, it's two actually, PewDiePie's and Drama Alerts. And like, it's ridiculous how it's become such a big thing and I find it's really, really stupid how news outlets do this and how Maker Studios dropped him and every, everything. And like, he's not a racist, he's a comedian. Most of the people on this is are comedians. Look at Frankie Boyle. He's w probably w really racist, really stereotypical and everything. But he's funny. It's funny. People love that. And, like, if you can't deal with that, then don't watch his channel. Don't watch the stuff that he p posts. Like, I've come to a point that I don't even bother listening to the news because all the news outlets just print false news like cnn they tried to do something for hacking or something they had fallout 4 uh hacking when you're in the computer they had that on it in the fucking on the news like that is just so fucking stupid but yeah this is kind of just a little rant i hope you like favorite and subscribe and peace